Okay guys, so if you are watching this video, that means you got some problems with your Wi-Fi. So, uh, in this video I will tell you how to fix your wireless connection and what to do if it keeps disconnecting and reconnecting. So here you can see that uh, internet access, you may see yellow sign that uh, it keeps reconnecting and at the moment I can, as you can see I have already fixed that and I got maximum connection maximum connection so uh, how to fix this uh, problem first of all what you need to do so if you if you have a connection by using router you need to disconnect cable from router switch off your router and uh, connect connect uh, your laptop or PC directly to uh, network socket with, without router, without using router and check if your, uh, if your internet is working. If internet is not working in this case without router, it means that uh, you got problem and uh, you need to so uh, connection losing somewhere, maybe cable damaged or something uh, like this. So you need to can uh, ask your uh, internet provider for help. So if any, if uh, it's working good, so uh, without router, you connect your cable to your laptop and uh, your uh, internet is working good, then uh, problem is with your router so how to fix uh, so if uh, probably is with your router here are steps what you need to check so first of all go to uh, power management two ways how you can use this windows 7 windows 10 you can see is here uh, your battery in case if you are using laptop click right click go to uh, power options or another way, go to Start Menu, click on Control Panel, and here you need to select uh, Hardware. Uh, and here you can see Power Options. Click on it, and here are two options: Balance and High Performance. So here you need to click on Change Pan Settings. So I'm using High Performance, and I will click on Change Pan Settings. Here you can see change advanced power settings. Click on it. And here is what you need to do. You need to locate here wireless adapter settings. Click on it. Power saving mode. Click on it. And uh, make sure both are selected maximum performance. If there is other option like low power saving, you need to switch to maximum performance. Then click on OK. Apply close uh, so you can restart your computer and check if your Wi-Fi is working if it's not working go to my computer click right click properties and click on device manager you will see window like this one if uh, so uh, if everything is looks here like this without errors signs click on network adapters click on select your wireless here it is wireless adapter click on right click properties you will see window like this one then you need to go to power management and check if this is uh, unticked so allow the computer to turn off the device to save power so make sure this one is unselected. Click OK, close everything, restart your computer and check if Wi-Fi is working. In case if you see that uh, here are uh, some errors like uh, with a wireless adapter, uh, I will put link under this video to my website called Skillboom. Here is uh, solution on how to uh, how to install Wi-Fi driver to your computer so I will put link to, to this step-by-step uh, -step tutorial as well uh, 
here is uh, here is uh, okay. so here is a link and here is detailed tutorial where to click for example you see in your uh, device manager error like this on Chrome device that then it means you need to install your drivers here are links to all uh, models so click on for example if you are using the Dell click on here and you will see how to install driver for your Dell, Dell computer so uh, the next step of how to fix uh, so if everything looks like here correctly, let's close everything. There is also another way on how to fix uh, your uh, Wi-Fi. So you need to go to uh, computer, oh, sorry, control panel, network, internet. Uh, so here you need to open network and share center. Click on your connection, you will see a window like this one. Here you need to select wireless properties. Here you need to select connect even if the network is not broadcasting its name. So make sure to select this. Click on OK, close all windows, refer, uh, restart computer. In case if Wi-Fi keeps dropping, go to security, click on, on the same tab. Go to security, advanced settings, and make sure to select this option. So this one, this option was uh, really helped me to fix my problem. So this was where the my problem starts. So I have fixed this, and my Wi-Fi start working. This was located in security, advanced settings. Once more time. So uh, and finally the last step what you, you can select uh, what you can check for your Wi-Fi so uh, so if problem with your router you need to in your browser go to your router so possibly this could be one of these addresses like like this or like this so enter use standard password like admin admin or simply using the admin without password and click on sign in so when sign in you will be accessed to your router here click on wireless and select uh, so here is wireless settings so make sure to select your region so select your country otherwise if your country will be wrong this may cause some problems with your uh, Wi-Fi settings local settings so make sure to select your country correctly and the last step what you need to do is uh, if you are living in a flat or uh, in a house where too many routers or users you need to change channel you need to some routers use automatic I have also using automatic but I have switched it to manually why I have done this so for example there is such program called Wi-Fi info view. So I will open it. In this small program, it shows all, all networks in this range. So uh, as you can see, I have got two more networks in range, and they are using channel one, channel two, and I also was use, using channel one. So I have uh, changed channel to another one, to free one. So this channel was nobody using and I have selected it. And I have done this from drop down menu. And after that I have clicked save and rebooted my router. And everything starts working good. Uh, so in the last step, as I showed you before, uh, the most common error is simply in security settings. So make sure to go to control panel, as I showed you before, network and internet, network and sharing center, click on your wireless network connection to open a window like this, click on wireless properties, make sure this one is selected, and here in security center, advanced settings, make sure this one also selected, and click on OK, OK, close, and reboot your computer, and after that, 
problem, problem should be disappeared and your connection could be in maximum performance. Uh, if for some reason, guys, this uh, didn't help you, make sure to comment. Uh, in any way, please comment, did this video help you? And if not, describe your pro problem, what you have tried, what you have done, and I will try to provide solution for you. No need to fix your computer and Wi-Fi. Okay, guys, have a nice day and have a good day. Bye.